Yo, what's going on, guys? Matthew V. Hazer, aka, AKA the Clockmaster. <laughs> I'm here with Captain Phil. Um, so we are gonna be reviewing the last, the last episode of the Flash. I'm about to say what show we did. <laughs> it's pronounced bruh. That's that's what it's pronounced. Of the it's Flash, um, episode 23, the finale episode. Okay. Thoughts together. This episode was by far, I would say, the best episode for the entire season. You agree? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It had to be. It's the season finale. It had Get to be. back in frame. There you go. But he's he's not DC though. It don't matter. All right, we but go. He, but he dead though. <laughs> but he dead. He not dead. He, he he died though. No, he's not. He's teenager now. But he died. Okay. Never mind. All right. Making a Cisco reference, I, as you see, I failed. Epic. No, I got, I got you, but no, you're not okay. dead, though. No. He died, though. Uh, thoughts uh, on the episode? <laughs> <laughs> um, bruh, there's a, there's a lot to talk about. Um, let's see, the whole thing with, uh... I have this question. Do you really think that... Savitar could actually like could have lived a uh, a better life somehow, some way. You know that scene where Barry's talking to him one on one, and obviously you saw him. He he had those emotions. You saw him tear up a little bit. It was real emotions too. It was yeah. not. It was not fake. Do like, you that think was, that, that was far from being that was far from being fake? Let him be a, a normal. Well, using the pen, of course, because you don't want to see. Burned. Yeah, yeah, too too Barry. Barry. But, I mean, we would have to accept him for who he is, though. Because we would have to accept him as being um, Barry. Because, you remember, that's the main reason in the first place that he turned the way he turned. Because they rejected him because of how he looked and him not being the real Barry. Mm -hmm. They rejected him. So, we don't want that. We want, you know, for him to disguise his face. I mean, the pen. People look at the pen as this whole solution. And I, I have a nitpicky thing with the pen thing, which I'm going to talk about later. Because... Some things didn't make any sense to me. But I, I don't know, man. But I mean, if we were to just, you know, like I said, recap the episode from everything that has happened, you know, we find out that Iris didn't die. Okay, we find out that, that you know, we, they switched places. Remember, we said that it's possible, but it just didn't make sense how people was explaining it. But right. I like how the show was able to explain it and make it make sense. Like they were able to make it actually make sense. Before right. it wasn't made before it just was not making any sense. Um, but I like how they used it with the whole, um, you know, his uh spear thing, you know, pulling back an HR because I, I would say that's the most genius thing HR has ever done, mm -hmm. really. Because, like, I would never even thought about them even doing that to begin with in the first place, right? You exactly. Know? So, I mean, I, I, I don't know, I'm, I, I was very happy about that, and then I was it was sad to see HR die though, it was. Man. I mean, like, I think it hurt me more. Than actually Iris dying, yeah, because you were you saw it from like was it was it episode one of the season or a couple <laughs> he was episodes? he was yeah a couple episodes in I think like episode two I think he showed up but no not even showed up but like you saw um Iris her uh oh her dying picture, yeah yeah yeah, her, yeah, yeah. I, I, it wasn't episode one it was definitely before episode fourteen fourteen okay all right. around there I don't, yeah I, don't yeah. I forget exactly which one yeah well. Episode one of the, like the mid-season um, premiere, I guess. You I think say? so. Yeah, yeah. Um, you were prepared to see Iris die. Yeah. So, and you've seen all the visions that Cisco's been having. So you're like, okay, Iris, um, for the most part, is gonna die. However, everything changed. Everything stopped. Yeah. Someone had a, a master plan to save Iris. Exactly. But in doing so, they had to dig their own grave. It's craziness. I don't know, man. That episode really hit me a lot. I was just like, what? I just remember watching it, and then I saw like I saw it on your um, reaction too. I saw like the green. I don't know 
what it was on the screen. Yeah, yeah it was happening with and, everybody. Yeah, and like it was my glitching. TV cut out. Too. Everybody, yeah, my TV was, was glitching was like, too. You can't do yeah, that. To me. Yeah, yeah. You can't just show me this and then cut out. No, that's not yeah. <laughs> my TV, my TV was my TV was glitching too. Like I thought I was the only one that was getting the problem. But my, right. pretty, I think everybody's TV was glitching, or whatever was happening with the network. I was like, network. bro, I'm about to really text you, like, bro, they yeah, really, like, they, like they cut off. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but I don't know. I mean, that, that, I mean, I felt like that episode was really full of just so much stuff was happening in that episode. Right. It felt like three episodes in one. I felt like if everything that happened in this episode could have been extended into like three um, little episodes. I gotta show you, um, Akasan. You know Akasan? He's another YouTuber. He uh, he did he did a reaction to the episode, and at the beginning of his reaction, he posted a, a little like a little skit, um, voiceover skit as to how the episode should have ended. Mm -hmm. I should show. Am I afraid? Let me let me show you now, bro. Let me just show you. Then also that dynamic between Killer Frost as well and her, you know, really trying to find herself. I guess if you want to say that her not to return back to Caitlyn because it's like I saw um, my buddies. Uh, uh, Jacqueline and Marcella, they you guys you guys should know them. I did a video with them already. Drowning in Fandom Fields, um, that's their, their YouTube channel name. Um, and they um, they were talking about how they you know she has to come to grips with everything that she's that she, they were discussing this in their reaction that mm -hmm. she has to come to grips with whatever she did as Killer Frost because it's easy to just take the drink and be like oh that wasn't me that was Killer Frost that did all that bad stuff right. so um props to them for, for even seeing that because I wasn't even thinking about that but um yeah I mean I agree with them like you have to she has to come to grips with whatever she did and say hey look this is what I did and this is how I have to move on from this point on as Someone else, something else. <laughs> Remind me of somebody. Reminds Remind me of, of a, somebody, of right? A certain, uh, <laughs> of a certain character. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so man. I, sure. I, 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 um, I mean, the episode was just fantastic. I mean, I'm just skipping through. There's so much stuff that happened. Um, we're gonna save the ending for last. I want to talk about some Flash Rebirth stuff too. Um, that everyone, which I really wanted to talk about. But um, another thing that happened. Another thing that was really sad too was um, HR's funeral for me, man. That thing was so sad, bro. Really sad. And then when uh, 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 Wally was like, "Oh, thanks for believing in me." Mm -hmm. I was like, "Yo, that hurt. That hit me, bro." Cause I'm like, "Yeah, he was the only one that actually believed in him at the beginning." Right. So that was. hit me, yo. I was like, dang. Dad. I was like, I was like, HR was like a father figure or a friend to him, like an older brother mm -hmm. or like an uncle or something. Right, like, right. I was like, dang. That and um, when I saw Cisco like take out the drumsticks, yeah, I was like, bro. Oh my god, this is really bro. it. That hit me, bro. That really hit me. That the really Mark Twain quote they put on his yeah, tombstone, yeah, bro, and the John Lennon reference too. Yeah, bro, they really hit all the all the hurt spots in this episode. Like they really um, hit all the the soft parts of me, um, cause I was like, man, that, that thing got me feeling things, man. I think I had me feeling things, man. But like, I mean, I'm glad so, that they had everybody in there. Yeah, everybody. You had Jay Garrett. You had Gypsy. They missed the, Jesse though. Yeah, that's the thing. They didn't have Jesse in there. I was really hoping to see Jesse again because I like Jesse. I got a big crush on that Jesse. I wanted, been, I wanted to, I wanted that wanted to see her again, man. Crazy. And that speaking sequence, of Jesse, that fight, that sequence, that would have been so crazy if Jesse was in there, bro. If Jesse had just flew in, I heard, I, uh, I heard you guys needed some help, right, bro? Over, son. And um, I saw someone comment like the fight should have been a little bit longer, mm. but. I understand because like I mean I guess budgeting stuff too. They were like, oh I guess plus I it's guess a flash. plus is a flash too, yeah. They're, they're like supposed to be quick and I know no but but we're seeing it from their perspective. Yeah, it's true. So it should have been a, I mean well I mean they said well it's it's not it well it shouldn't have been longer, it's just that we wanted it to be longer. Oh yeah. We wanted it to be longer. It's not Everybody like it should have yeah, uh, yeah. A fight scene that's like so um so drawn out. Yeah. We, we just wanted it to be longer, but I mean that sequence was amazing, yo. Savitar would, but it's like cutting the tree, and then, and then he, he gets up in the lightning. <sighs> oh my just, gosh! Savitar cutting the trees, and then Wally was like, "I'm gonna go under the branch, <sighs> do some Batman stuff real quick." Right? Man, yo, that was that was an amazing sequence. Jay Garrick when he showed up, that was like. Loved it, bro. I mean, that scene was just amazing. And then Iris shooting Barry, bro. Shooting, well, shooting, shooting Savitar. Okay. Even though he is Barry. 
Barrytar to be more to differentiate the two. Right. Um, man, everybody was like, "How?" <laughs> I saw comments. I was like, "How is um?" No, I, didn't, I don't know if I showed you the, the post. My friend, my my, uh, my friend texted me this um this thing from Instagram. He was like, "I showed it to you after we record," but he was like, "How is um Savitar?" Because Savitar was inconsistent. The story writers were inconsistent with him. So they're like, "How how the heck is Savitar able to get shot?" by a bullet moving at regular bullet speed and he's moving fast enough to, to hear it coming mm -hmm. and then but then everybody was like but as i rewatched it i saw him like he wasn't moving that fast right like he was he just got up he was and like charging up yeah he was charging he up didn't. so like he wasn't moving that fast i did see that so i mean but based off the meme i was like i was laughing but like after i rewatched my reaction and a couple and um uh, Jacqueline and Marcella's reaction. I was rewatching it. I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was possible for Iris to shoot him, but I'm like, I was yeah. not expecting. That. I thought Plus it was gonna he, be like Joe. Didn't see it at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had his back turned. But I mean, as a speech, so you'll be able to hear those things, though. Yeah, that's true. But like, but he wasn't I even guess moving at super speed yet. That, and I don't even think that he was focused on that. Yeah, really, he was just focused on like he had his tunnel vision, focused on trying to get back at Barry yeah. for destroying his suit. Plus all the fighting that he endured in mm -hmm. there. I don't think that and he, plus was, he like, was And plus he was weakened as well. Yeah. Too, so, yeah. I, 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 I mean, think his suit uh, gave him like the edge mm -hmm. in terms of speed when going up against Barry. Someone was saying that the reason why the suit so. was red when Barry got in it was not because of his lightning, but because the suit was getting low on power. <laughs> oh, about it. Yeah. That red. <laughs> so it's like no, it's not because they were like no, nah, it's not. It's like no, nah, it's not because Barry is um is in the suit. He's like no, nah, it's because we're just getting low on power. I was like, <laughs> I was like okay. I was like, you know, I was like all right. But um, I wanted to investigate that some more though. For real though, I I don't know. I I really like what they did with the the suit lighting up bread yeah. because you saw Barry like really um, ticked off. I don't know if I could say pissed on this channel. Of course, man, what the I, heck? I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't know. I'm new to this YouTube thing. Um, Barry was really pissed off and that's when you really saw him like enraged and he's like, about, who knows what he was about to do. He was about to kill Savitar himself, you know, mm -hmm. pulling out that, uh, that yeah. uh, what do you call it? I guess whatever that that spirit that thing. Wolverine yeah, 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 yeah. The only Wolverine, one claw one claw looking yeah middle finger claw thing <laughs> <laughs> oh no man but like I mean that was it was I think it was a great fight scene they ended it well he disintegrated people just to answer your question guys I know one of you guys if you're watching this far which that means you're that means you're interested in what we have to say um but uh just to answer one of you guys' questions, you were like, how is Wally able to still have a speed and Barry in Savitar is dead? Now, the only answer I can come up with is sim the reason why he lost it in the first place. It was I never, I don't agree with this reason, but this is the reason I have. The only reason he lost his speed in the first place was because uh, uh, Barry Tar lost his memory. So he doesn't remember giving him the speed. So that's why he, no, but they said that. They said because he lost his memory, because remember when uh, uh, Barry they did whatever, they erased his memory, mm -hmm. okay? Um, some events never, like it's like it never happened or whatever. But so, didn't they regain their memories though? They did, no, they did. So they're, so they're saying, the, I'm, I'm asking a question because they were like, okay, ba uh, Sav uh, Barry Tar is dead, so how is uh, Wally still have his speed? So this is the answer to the question. Um, the only reason he lost it was because According to Flash logic, um, that Barry Barry Tar lost his his memory, so he doesn't remember make uh, creating Wally. So Wally's is is down. But you remember, as long as a Barry is still alive and all the memories are still there, mm -hmm. then he'll still be good. So if Barry Tar is dead, he's a remnant. An Barry, another Barry is still alive. So he's still he's still gonna be uh, Wally's still gonna have his speed. Um, it's, it's only if if ba I think if Barry lost his memory again, then Wally would lose his speed, according to Flash logic. That's the only answer I can come up with um, to that question. Um, right. But I mean, um, the ending now, the ending with Barry going into the Speed Force. How did we were talking about early how it, like how all of a sudden he, um, um, Mommy Master was here. Uh, we were talking earlier um, about 
how all of a sudden he was he just dropped. He was like, okay, well, I'm ready to get married to you. Well, never mind. I'm going into the speed I force. Was like, <laughs> I was like, of course, of course, something would happen now that the big bad wolf is gone. Of course, mm -hmm. something else occurs. Oh my gosh, a time quake. Well, what happened? What was? Was the whole like time quake or whatever that was happening, the speed force um, coming down onto Earth uh, one? Did that happen prior? Was that happening prior to? Uh, remember when uh, Wally or Flash told uh, Wally to get everybody else out of the realm and tell, and he got out of his. That's out of there. an unanswered question too with the was philosopher's that, stone thing. Yeah, what what happened with that? Was they that never answered of? that. I yeah. don't think that was part of it because they never answered that question. They never answered that question. I thought that was part of like something that happened. Yeah. I don't know, some kind like, of what like, the heck happened? Why the some philosopher's kind of stone thing? I I didn't see. And like I said, guys, I didn't watch any other videos or anybody else explaining it. So maybe there's someone else that did explain it. But for me personally, I didn't. I don't watch things until I do my review first. Um, I didn't know. I didn't see any answers. I didn't like see what that was. I never answered why the philosopher's stone was there and why everything just all of a sudden just went poof. Right. Right. It's, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, connected. maybe, maybe it had uh, something to do with it. I thought it was connected. But, but then the Speed Force said it's because it doesn't have an inhabitant for the prison. Right, right. I so, think that probably. Because they didn't show uh, Jay Garrick. They didn't show a scene where Jay Garrick got out of the Speed Force. I mean, they showed him they showed, like, they, get they, out they of showed, the portal. They showed him come out the portal, yeah. But yeah, but like, there's got to be like some kind of like... Well, I mean, Something. I don't know like, if he was like, like the speed force. To... The speed force did say that, um, and they did, and Jay discussed this too. Right when they realized it was the speed force, they were like, "Oh well, the speed force doesn't have anyone in the prison, so that it, right now it's looking for someone to inhabit that space. Right, right. So that's why Barry gave up himself. Now he's just like, man, why would you just just do that? It's like why, and, but I don't know. I mean, now season four predictions. Flash Rebirth stuff. Now, I read Flash Rebirth by Jeff Johns. One of my favorite, is my favorite story of the Flash I've ever read so far. Um, I think it's even better than this story here. I don't know if you guys can see it properly, but this is the DC Rebirth story from last year. Um, this is like the, the introduction to the button stuff with Batman, but I think it's better than that. Um, the thing is, in that story, right before it, Barry faces a guy named the and I'm making I'm gonna make another video next next week explaining exactly the flash rebirth stuff in more detail uh, because that can take up a whole 20 minutes alone but basically in the comics Barry actually sacrifices himself because he faces a person um, named the monitor and who creates this dark matter field or whatever and Barry has to sacrifice himself and he dies goes into the speed force returns um, in the sil you know Silver Age stuff, so we're talking about J uh, Jeff Johns things. He returns, and he because um, he was into the sp in the Speed Force, and he was presumed dead. So Kid Flash now becomes Wally West. I mean, I keep saying that Kid Flash now becomes the Flash. Wally West now becomes the Flash. I keep saying Kid Flash now becomes Wally West. It's stupid. Um, becomes the Flash. He goes from being Kid Flash to the Flash. Correct. Uh, I'm correcting my my my. Error there, sir. I got it. sorry. Um, so he becomes the official Flash, and everyone, you know, assumes that uh, Barry is dead. He comes out to Speed Force. It was there was a time jump. So people keep asking, you know, is there gonna is there gonna be a time jump in season four? I think there will be. If they're if they're going the Flash rebirth rebirth route, there will be. Now a lot of you guys don't know what happens in Flash rebirth. Actually, he goes into the Speed Force. He comes out. When he comes out, everything's different. You know, he's a little different. He's a whole different person. Bart Allen is there, um, while the US kids are there, um, one of them becomes a new impulse, um, uh, Max Mercury, Liberty Bell, Jesse Quick, all the speedsters are there. Reverse Flash creates a negative speed force, it's crazy. And uh, Barry becomes the Black Flash, not because of anything, but because he only becomes a Black Flash because Eero Barthon created the negative speed force. So he touched, uh, he killed Savitar on site. He killed Lady Flash on site um, because by touching them by accident. So, you know, I don't want to get the full details of the comic because, like I said, I'll make another video. I, I did do a review on it, which I will post right up here in the description box below. Um, but Lady Flash, who was worshipped, oh, God. 
<laughs> Lady Flash, who was worshipping Savitar in the comics, um, was mad. So Barry was trying to chase Savitar down because he, he escaped the Speed Force. He's like, no, what are you doing out here? Savitar's running away. You're like, no, don't touch me, B. He touches him. <laughs> He's like, nah, bro. And then uh, um, the Flash touches him and by accident kills Savitar. And then he didn't know what was going on. And then he, the Lady Flash fought, uh, fights Wally West, who is now the Flash now, and Barry. And they're fighting, and then he touches Lady Flash, and she's dead. On, on contact. So, and becomes a Black Flash, and so on and so forth, and everything. So, if they're going the Flash rebirth route, it'll be definitely interesting show to make. With him coming out, the Speed Force, and there's a time jump, is a couple of years into the future. Um... I can definitely see them doing that. Um, Legends might have something to um, might put a put a couple twists into that. Well, yeah, I don't know if you saw this. No, you could discuss. Now. You could discuss it though, because I because I, even though I didn't see it yet, but you, you can discuss no, it. No, no, I'm gonna I'm let you. You want to watch it? Because I'm not gonna catch it on anytime soon. You're gonna be like, bruh. So this whole Reaper theory, I mean, there's gonna be some tweaks in there. Yeah, there will be some tweaks now. Right, well, Legends. yeah, well, it's only yeah, it's only because I haven't seen um the last the, uh, the half of the season of Legends of Tomorrow season two. So that's the only Bro. reason why I'm 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 like not with it. Gone goes uh, Madara. He does something that Madara does in in Shippuden. In Naruto, he does something. He's like, oh. all right, well, now I gotta catch up now. He's like, okay, fine. You want to do this? All right, all right, that's cool. I'm gonna do this. And then you're like, whoa, okay, huh. all right. Well, we'll see, man. I definitely <laughs> think that they took some inspiration from the Flash Reaper because the, in my reaction, I don't know if you guys saw it, but my first thought that came to my mind was rebirth. This is rebirth. This is hands down rebirth. Barry sacrifice, being selfless and sacrificing himself to go in like that is rebirth stuff. Him that is infinite crisis stuff. That's new everything. Crisis. Because keep in mind they uh, killed Frost. Um, killed, killed Hunter's Almond. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Killed the previous Black. Fi well, previous. Once again, uh, Le Legends Legend Tomorrow did some weird yeah, stuff too. Legends yeah. Tomorrow. I don't know. It's, all right. I'm gonna just go with like the Flash. Um, what's going on with Flash? With Flash, yeah. Yeah, Killer Flaws, Killer Frost. <laughs> Get yours today, Killer Floss. Ninety nine percent off. Floss. Discount code in the description box. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, we might get sued for that. No, it's Killer Floss. It's not a real product. Yeah, but you know, to my knowledge. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but that was not a sponsored message. Just in case Killer Floss is a real company, that was completely not a sponsored message, by the way. Anyways, right. yeah. <laughs> yeah, Killer Frost mm -hmm. um, does what she does, I guess, best and killed Black uh, Flash. Mm -hmm. So there needs, there has to be some kind of Black Flash yeah. out there. Yeah, and it, and it wouldn't be shocking if it is Barry. Right. You know, if he comes out the Speed Force. Yeah, but like I said, guys, I made. I'm, I'm gonna make a more in-depth video explaining Rebirth stuff um, as the weeks go on and stuff like that. I'll, I'll get more in-depth with Rebirth. Um, but I mean, all in all, guys, I really hope because they're talking about um, the Thinker being the villain for season four. I'm hearing that, uh, Devoe. I'm hearing a lot of rogues, and I can understand why after watching Legends. Yeah. Yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been hearing. I've been hearing the rogue stuff too. Um, there's that. I've heard Devoe, you know, Thinker stuff. I've also heard of maybe Godspeed stuff. They were saying maybe one of those lightning hit someone and becomes, you know, someone becomes Godspeed. And yeah, I've been hearing, I've been hearing a lot of stuff rumors. about it, man. Cobalt prior to Blue season four. Pri yeah, prior to season four. Cobalt Blue rumors, which doesn't make any sense to me, but because Cobalt Blue is Malcolm Thawne, Barry's evil twin brother, but that's a whole other conversation. But, um,. It could happen. It could happen. I mean, I, I the way how this show is, this show is very surprising. I just hope that season four will be better than this one. I hope it has more twists. It has more turns and surprises. It's always progressed. Flash seasons have always progressed. Starts with like your Barthon and then like uh, Hunter Zolomon, um fooling everybody and thinking he's Jay Garrett. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that was that was a big that was a big Zoom, surprise. And then uh, Jay Garrett looks like Barry's dad and all that. Uh -huh. stuff. Oh my gosh! Yeah. And then now, uh, like, oh my gosh, the Big Bad Wolf is actually the hero himself, mm -hmm. kinda. And yeah, they've always progressed. There's a reason why the Flash has a 98% on Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah. 
Some yeah, there's a re there is a reason. There is a reason. Deserve it. I don't know, man. Any anything else that we forgot or anything you need to talk about? Um. Yeah, you haven't watched Arrow, like, bruh. Nah, I haven't watched it. I've been caught up on Super Supergirl either. I don't know what's going. I heard on. what happened at the end. Whatever. My mom won't tell you. My mom, my mom told me, but. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna go watch it as soon as I'm out of the uh, Clock Masters time vault. <laughs> yeah. But um, yeah, I'm gonna just catch up on that, and I'm gonna tweet Matt a whole bunch of stuff like, bruh, bruh. What's going on? Wait, uh, Supergirl, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because after watching Legends finale and watching the Flash finale, I'm like, bruh, everything is like, everything's not everything. Man, I'm gonna, wa I'm gonna watch what's, it. I'm gonna watch it. What's accurate? What's I'm accurate? behind, man. What is accurate, people? Seriously, I don't know what's what to really believe. And now you're talking about uh, Barry Allen might be Black Flash, and I'm like, wait a minute, I just, bruh, <laughs> right? Oh my god. I don't know. That's that's only if the show is going to rebirth route though. If they're going to rebirth route, then I can see it. If they're not going to rebirth rebirth route, then alright. Bro, my head gonna hurt afterwards. My, my head, head hurting right hurt. now, B. <laughs> my, head <gonna> <laughs> my head hurting right now, man. I don't um, know, man. Question. I know we talked about this earlier, but going back, let's go back to the HR thing about HR dying. Yeah. Do you think they really could have rushed them to the hospital? Well, it got based some on kind of treatment, based on what everyone was saying, you know, everyone's like, you know, yeah, because if he, he's Harrison Wells is wanted man, right. if they saw him, they'd probably arrest him right on site. And then, I mean, the solution to that too could just be use the pen to disguise his face. But then again, you know, he still has the same blood as Harrison Wells. Once they do blood checks, they can already be like, yeah, yo, this you is got, Harrison you Wells. Got a flash, and uh, but not just that too. The, the, the man does have a big hole in his chest going through his heart so yeah that's but the thing is they've been talking for like how long yeah more than two minutes i mean the flash i mean I, at that point at that point based on a lot you know based on just re, if you rewatch it i mean based on that point he's already a dead man you know i'm just i mean i can understand like barry is not an idiot i think he knows how to yeah kill somebody you know yeah, for good. You know, yep. He knows how to kill somebody. But for then good. again, yep. he was talking for that time, and I'm like, dude. Because you know he was gonna die. I mean, to the hospital though. It's not like he's doing a, a bleach run where he's like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like, and then back. You know? I don't yeah. know. I mean, run, rushing, 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 rush, to, the rushing to the hospital. I don't think you know, that he'll be arrested on set. I mean, right. I, and plus, I don't even think they would. I don't think they would be thinking about that. Right. I don't even think they were thinking about that. They're just like. I think at that point Barry's just still in shock at the point that wait a minute my girl ain't dead right like what right. like Barry's all like I don't know what to do like like my girl's not dead but I but, lost but I lost a friend like what the heck and then Barry's trying to keep his composure and like you know I mean so much stuff is going on in that moment so I mean there's not enough time in the world to really avert that kind of thing you know I don't know man it's crazy yeah, it's crazy lost HR still got Iris though yeah. Still got Irish, yeah. Anyways, guys, man, you let us know in the comment section down below what are your thoughts on this final, se uh, final, I said final season, final episode of oh this gosh. season of the Flash. If this you is the final people, season, you know how many bro, people, bro, riots, bro, riots. Everywhere. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying that it would be like a, a, a okay. No, season. They, would, they would not like, end the season like a, that, bro. No okay way. Season. I mean, like. All right, I'm done. I passed the torch on. Heck no. He's now the Flash. No. And that's it. And a good, still, point, a good point somebody a good point somebody made to me. The show is named The Flash. That is true. And it does it's not named Barry, Barry Allen. Allen. So even if Bar even if Barry is not in the whole, for like half the show or not even in this season at all, right. It would still be called The Flash because Wally West is The Flash as well. Right. Jay Garrick is The Flash. It's still The Flash. You know what I'm saying? So the show is still The Flash. I wouldn't mind seeing some Wally West villains. Because I know yeah. Godspeed is a main villain of Wally West. Right. So I wouldn't mind seeing some God, some Wally West villains. And I mean, I wouldn't mind. I mean, I'd miss Barry. You know, but um, if, the sh if they sp focus half of the season focusing on Wally, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't yeah, mind, to I be honest. Mind. I wouldn't mind. It would be a different perspective. The show is called The Flash. But I think they would need some, like... I think Barry, Wally would need some help, though. I think... Uh, uh, Jay Gary would have to be there. Yeah, mentor. but he's already gained a lot of experience through this whole entire season. Yeah, but still, there's a lot of stuff that he 
should know about a lot of yeah, stuff. Yeah, and plus, and plus Barry, Barry, the only person that that, that that had a little that was helping Barry was uh was was Harrison Wells, because he was Ear Barthon. So he was helping him grow, but a lot of stuff, you know, Barry also did some growing as well himself. Right. So, you know, I, I guess you will need that mentorship there. Because um, while Wally was there, Barry was his mentor. Because keep in mind, Wally didn't really, I mean, yeah, he stopped some people here and there. But he's never gone and uh, saved somebody or do something really alone yeah. on all on his own. He didn't I mean, he's done a couple up, things on his own. Yeah, he's done like, a couple of things, but like... Go up against other meta Because look at it though, Jesse. On Jesse's on Earth three, doing mm. things by herself. Right. By herself, without any mentorship. Right. Keep that in mind. So it's it. I could definitely. I mean, it's not that it's completely impossible. You know what I mean? It is possible, but. But I think you'll definitely need help with some other like meta humans that they're going up against. Yeah. So. I mean, even with Vibe, I don't know if Cisco's gonna be like a hero full time, mm -hmm. cause he's still iffy about it. I don't know why he's still iffy about it. Mm -hmm. He could easily get training from Gypsy. I mean, yeah, yeah, that's true. That's you true. Know, they're connected, jackass. Mm -hmm. What she said. Yeah, yeah. Quoting her, it was like, wow. Wait a minute. I don't know. Call me dumb, but I don't know what they meant by that. Yeah. Like they I don't connected. know. I really don't. They said they're connected. I don't know what they meant by that. Do they mean by powers? Do or they by mean... relation? Are they brother and, and, and are they related that by would blood? Be, that would, bruh. Are they related oh by blood God. for some reason? Everything <laughs> I know is a lie. Everything I know is a lie. But if she knew that, is she that would. A... She wouldn't. She would be kind of, be kind of creepy. That she was, that she kissed her own brother. Uh, that she kissed her her own. I don't think. I don't think yeah, I don't think it's that. Nah, 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 nah. But it was like, yo. Yeah, yeah. That would be a FDR and Eleanor Roosevelt. Oh my God, we're not even oh. going there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, anyways, I just remember. Good, I just remember my oh, history man. teacher telling me like, yeah, but they're like so many like. I don't different. care, bro. Yeah, I don't. don't care. I don't care, bro. We not messing with care. that, bro. No, you just told us that Teddy Roosevelt and FDR are related. And now you mean to tell me this is nah, like close nah, enough. Nah, I'm like, nah, no, nah, nah, no, nah, nah, you don't do that. No. <laughs> Anyways, guys, like I said, man, subscribe if you're new, man. Leave your comments down below. All that great stuff, man. Once again, check out our social medias and everything. We'll see you guys in the next video, man. Clockmaster and Captain Phil. Out. Tank on it. <laughs> I, was, I was late. I'm sorry. I was late. I was late. But I didn't leave you hanging, though. I didn't leave you hanging, though.